Hey guys, it's Arika Misha, and today we are cooking buffalo chicken wings. Actually, they're gonna be baked. I'm gonna put them in the oven. Baked buffalo chicken wings. All right, and you guys know, you already know, I've got my wings already. They've been marinating all night. You guys know how I do it. So I've got my pan here ready. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna spray my pan with some oil with my, um. you guys know my old faithful uh, Publix uh, canola cooking spray. Just spraying my pan with that. And the reason why I'm doing that is so that my uh, chicken wings do not stick to my pan. So I'm just gonna put my wings in here. Got my flats. Just gonna line it up. Gonna get these all in here all nice and pretty. Gonna get these all grilled and baked up really good. Then once they get all nice and brown, a nice crispy golden brown, I'm gonna see if I can kind of spread these out a little bit, but let me see first. I'm gonna get all the chicken in here first. But yeah, what we wanna do, I've got my oven, before I forget, I've got my oven preset to 425 degrees, guys. 425 degrees. And I'm gonna cook these for about 30 minutes. I'll see how that goes. Might not need 30 minutes, but we'll see. Yeah, so we're gonna get these in the oven so they can get all nice and brown and crispy. Just showing you guys how I'm lining them up in my pan. See if I got enough room, how much room I got here. Get everybody in there, give them space. So everybody can cook all nicely. And I love the smell, the season on a chicken that's been sitting all night and marinating all night long. All right, so let's do this. Put, some, put a flat over there. Got one more flat. Let's see where I'm going to put that. I'll put that right there. Yeah, let's spread these out so they can have room to cook. So, all right. I got them all nice and spread in my pan. They've got plenty of room. Get my hands washed here. I love, everybody loves buffalo wings. Um, I like fried buffalo wings. I like baked buffalo wings. But when you bake them, let me zoom you guys in a little bit more so you guys can see that chicken. When you, um, not that much, okay. But yeah, when you, when you uh, bake, the, when I bake my wings, I like to make sure they get a nice, you know, crispy uh, crunch on the outside. Not too crunchy like you're frying them, but a nice little uh, crisp on the outside. So this is what I do. I spray them with the canola oil. Now, this is gonna help get them all nice and brown and crispy for you. That is the trick. So, all right, we've got our um, chicken wings all ready. We're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna, like I said guys, I've got the oven preheated, 425 degrees. I'm gonna put them in for about 30 minutes and see how that goes. So, all right, I will be back. Let me get these in the oven, 425, 30 minutes guys. Let's see how that looks. Uh, we're gonna do buffalo uh, chicken wings and we're gonna do some french fries. All right, I'll be back guys. Okay, I just took my um, chicken wings out of the oven. As you guys can see, they are nice and brown and crispy. Now, what I'm getting ready to do, I'm gonna go ahead and add my buffalo sauce, and today I am using Moore's Original Buffalo Wing Sauce. All right, that's what we're using today. I'm just gonna take my buffalo sauce and pour it over the wings. And then I'm gonna stick my wings back in the oven for about a good 10 minutes so that the um, wings can get that buffalo taste all nice and baked in. All right. Just gonna pour my sauce over it like that.
Make sure they get all nice and covered with the buffalo sauce. That's going to bake right in. That's going to be so good. I can eat one right now. But I'll wait. And this buffalo sauce smells so good. It smells like that old school buffalo sauce before they start doing all that fancy stuff with the buffalo sauce. But yeah, just make sure your wings get all covered. And you know what? Baked is a healthy alternative. Because y'all know I'll fry something in a minute now. I'll fry the wings in a minute. But I bake them sometimes. I like the baked ones too. I just like to make sure they get nice and crispy. Make sure we got everybody covered here now. Because cause with me pouring of the sauce like this, I'm also um, going to make sure the bottom of the wings get, you know, covered in the sauce too. We're just going to put this in the oven like that. All right. Take y'all in so y'all can see how it looks. I've got the wings all draped in the sauce. And I just kind of take my pan. My pan is hot at the time because I just took it out of the oven. And then just kind of shake it like that, you know. So the bottom of the wings, they're getting some sauce too at the bottom down there. Hot, hot, hot. So, you know, to make sure the bottom of your wings got some sauce too. Yes, because we need everybody to be all nice and saucy. Nice and saucy. Yes, make sure the bottom of your wings get some sauce too. Mm, that sauce is delicious. Let me bring y'all out. Ooh, it's spicy too. That old school buffalo sauce. I love it. <coughs> A little spice there. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and get these back in. My oven's still at 425, still nice and hot. I'm going to go ahead and get these back in the oven for about 10 minutes, guys. I'll be back to let you guys see how those finishing baked buffalo wings look. Okay, I just pulled our baked buffalo wings out the oven, and it smells good, and they look good. So let me take y'all in, of course. Ooh, look at them. And yes, y'all, I did put the parsley on there. I didn't let y'all see me do that because I wanted to surprise y'all with the parsley. So yeah, ooh, look at those baked buffalo wings. I don't think y'all can see good. Let me take y'all in a little bit more. Ooh, -wee. focus camera. There he goes. Focus. There it is. Look at the buffalo wings. Ooh, they look so good. So good. All that buffalo sauce. All baked in, guys. All baked in. <clears throat> All right, guys. Well, that's it. Y'all seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media, guys, especially over there on Instagram. I'm busy every day over there. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media, guys. Don't forget to do that. All right, and don't forget, knowledge is power. Bye.